Imagine how good making eggs would look with this cut sequence. Hey you, my name is Elon. and welcome to the weekly Wednesday vlog. Hashtag PM Edgar Wright challenge accepted. So I agreed with my friend Alan Lance Rod to go to his place to film because he's got a cool kitchen setup and he just installed a couple new LED lights which are generally kitchen purpose-y but they can be used for a pretty cool kitchen video sequence. So I buy half a dozen eggs on the way. By the way, we used all of them for these shots. We only had about 45 minutes to work so we got right down to the point. I really never filmed this kind of style before so we had to cook up all these motions and things out of the top of our head but I knew for certain that the shots have to be really short and to the point with really quick motions so you can make the fastest jump cuts as possible. So we filmed all this really fast and then I compiled it together into pretty much what is a fast jump cut sequence. Check it out. That is obviously just the raw jump cut sequence with no grading or anything and the reaction is probably like meh because you know you, you can tell the story it's got some kind of core but it's really not what we're shooting for. So then I dumped this entire sequence into After Effects and I animated the clips so I took about the first three to five frames of each clip and zoomed it in also by using the easy in and easy out on keyframes either zoomed it in or zoomed it out depending on the composition some and in, in one shot i think i even panned it from one side of the frame to the other luckily Alan's has an a7 III which means i could shoot in 4k which means zooming in and zooming out wouldn't ruin the quality of the footage on a 1080p sequence. After doing all the zoom ins and zoom outs I also color graded it a little bit and it looked kind of like this. That's a lot better, it's already got some style to it. The thing is some of the sound effects don't sound very good because the mic was using was on top of the camera. When it's closer up you hear them better, when it's further away you hear more echo and the sounds aren't so clear. So I found a bunch of sound effects matching what we were doing and inserted them around the clips. Plus I found all those whooshes that Edgar Wright uses in his movies and put them in underneath every zoom in, zoom out and all those effects and we got a final result which looks something like this. That's pretty cool considering we filmed this in like 30 minutes and edited it in like another 30 minutes. So the result I'm happy with. I wish I had more time to like play around a bit and make it super perfect, but that is for a brighter future. That is it, I hope to give you a little insight on how I made this Edgar Wright challenge style clip. Maybe it'll give you some inspiration. If you liked it, guys, hit the like button. If you want more video content, subscribe. And I'm gonna see you guys, as always, next week. I have to go prepare for choir because we're going to Austria for competition. Wink, wink, upcoming vlog.